In this tutorial, we will review the form we will be using for aggregate planning. This is just a form. Not all entries will be required for all plans. The forecast is entered here. This will be given for all of these problems. The plan for producing the items needed to fulfill demand is entered here. In the next tutorial where we learn to calculate costs, this will be given. In later tutorials, we will concentrate on learning to plan this section. In this section, we calculate the inventory for each period. In this section, we calculate the back orders for each period. In this section, we calculate the labor costs for the plan. In this section, we calculate the hiring and layoff costs for the plan. In this section, we calculate the subcontracting costs for the plan. In this section, we calculate the inventory costs for the plan. In this section, we calculate the back order costs for the plan. In this section, we calculate the period by period total costs for the plan. Finally, in this section, we calculate the total cost for each cost category in the plan. The bottom number will be the total cost of the plan. If you found that this video helped you with your operations management problem, please consider liking the video and even subscribing to the channel.